Well, we're back at it again with this big topic, aim assist in Fortnite. We're going to go over all the details what pro players talk about on Twitter, uh, from Tfue to Ninja to Aiden. Um, we're going to go over their tweets, we'll talk about it, then of course throw my two cents into it. And I want you guys to leave your feedback in the comment section below what you guys think about aim assist overall. Is it broken or not? So without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Is aim assist broken in Fortnite Battle Royale? Now I'm behind this shit. Bitch, I'm a savage. I spit at you bastards. I wonder what you're going to do to me, oh. I need to hear some more rapping. I'm just not impressed by your cash and your jewelry, oh. Are you my soldiers? And I'm a lieutenant. God damn it, you should be saluting me, oh. I hope you know I ain't going nowhere. Are you rapping? Just better get used to me, ho, oh, nigga. I must have blew on my jeans. Bought me a Jeep because I wasn't riding as much. My big account look Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy, Baller VC. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, man, we're going to go over this huge topic, of course, about aim assist. Once again, coming up in the Fortnite community. Everyone's talking about it on Twitter. And I guess how this all started was during the FNCS tourney, I guess, 1 through 15, the leaderboards for that tourney. All of them were all controller players, and people were pissed about that, and how controller players are just, like, taking over for a certain degree. Um, and again... I'm gonna put my two cents to it, and I want you guys to put and I want you guys to put your two cents into it in the comment section below. Do I think aim assist is broken? Yes, it is broken. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna be one of those controller players that's lying to you about this. It is broken. They gotta find a way to balance it, man. It's the linear settings. Everyone's using linear. I don't. I don't use a linear. I don't. I use exponential. I think this is just my personal opinion. I think exponential is probably. In a way more balanced than linear i feel like controller players should have to use exponential i use it because i like it i i don't i don't know it's hard to explain i i like using the exponential settings that's just me though and linear is probably the most broken thing in this game for controller players to use i feel like fortnite in a way maybe have to force everyone to switch to exponential take out linear i don't know I don't know how Epic's gonna do it, man, but we all gotta voice our opinions. Control players on PC, you gotta speak out the truth. You can't lie. You can't lie about this. It is broken. So, you know, again, I'm putting my two cents to it. It is broken. Epic needs to fix it. They need to balance it in a way because pretty soon, for it, you're gonna lose a lot of mouse and keyboard players, man. You're gonna lose a lot of them if you don't fix this problem. Now, I'm gonna play this clip that Ninja talks about aim assist and everything. So, here's the clip from Ninja talking about aim assist. Guys, another video, Ninja talking about Fortnite aim assist. We get it. Um, I don't really have anything to say about it in terms of what should happen. I'm reading Twitter, I've been checking and always following up on competitive. And apparently, in North America and AE, the top 15 or top 14 players, all controller on PC, of course. Um, and that's what we're talking about when we ever talk about aim assist. We're not talking about players on console. We're always talking about on PC with a controller plugged in. Uh, it's up to, it's going to be up to you guys. Like, I can't do anything. I don't use it. I, 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 it's going to be up to credible, top, competitive controller players who have a huge influence, who, you know, to, to reach out to Epic um, and, and be vocal about it and, and be honest about it um, if we want it to, or if you guys, we all, as a unit, want it to be more balanced uh controller aim assist is more you know it's performing way better than it does on xbox and playstation and shit when you're on pc um so yeah guys i mean it, you, people have to be vocal about it especially the players who are using it uh and and i, I see a lot of players obviously even aiden and a couple others are you know talking about how it is extremely broken it is extremely overpowered right now uh, on PC, and you know, if we get more people speaking up like that and being honest about it, I think we can actually get, uh, you know, a nerf or a change and make it more balanced and healthy, man. I want everyone to play together. Control players are amazing. It's incredible talent. I was a professional Halo player and competed on controller for for years, so I get it. Uh, you know, just want everyone to be happy, and I want the game to thrive. So, love you guys. Again, that was Ninja's response about aim assist, and I 100% agree with him about it. You just got to find a way to make a balance. And here's um, Aiden talking about it on Twitter. Then Ninja asked him the question, and then this is his response. You could pause it and read his response. He talks about, you know, linear is overpowered, is so strong. Um, again, I don't know if, if it works or not. Maybe Fortnite will push everyone to make them play on Exponential. I always played on Exponential since the season started. I never made the switch to Linear. People's always, people in my chat will always tell me, oh, you should switch to Linear. You know, it's so much better than Exponential. I don't use Exponential because I just, to me, I understand it's overpowered. 
but I always got so used to expect exponential I just stuck with it and I you know I just don't want to make the change and another thing is like more people are just gonna hate on me more than ever if I make that change it's like I already get hate enough that I, you know, all I hear is all control a player such you know control a player it's all it's all I hear and yeah it does get annoying after a while but if say if I made the switch to linear I would just get so much more hate than ever trust me on that but again I feel like Epic has to do has to do something about it. It's probably not going to be on this season, to be honest. The season's almost done. They're probably just going to wait till the next season to touch on it. Um, and again, I don't know what they can do about it. Again, during the the tourney yesterday, the FNCS tourney, even the casters were like joking around about controllers and everything. Like they're like, "What the hell, bro? What is this? What are we watching?" Because I saw a clip of that dude unknown. Like, 70 head dink them, like, some guy, like, twice, and then killed him instantly. And the caster's, like, he, he paused the clip, and then he just walked off. Like, it's broken. It's broken. And I saw someone, I don't know who said this, but another thing is, there is talented controller players out there. I feel like I am one of them. I forget who said this. But there are controller players that won't get the recognition because there's controller players out there that use linear because they know it's broken. And, you know, it takes away the talent from the people that actually are really good at con on controller. I'm not trying to sound cocky, but I feel like I am one, not one of the best, but I feel like I'm i am up there in a way for a controller player on this game. I do. I feel like I'm, I'm pretty good at this game with a controller in my hand. And, you know, I feel like players like me who actually are really good at the game, not, like, fucking br using a broken system in the game with linear doesn't get the recognition that much and again it sucks because like people like us don't won't get the recognition because other people lo are looking like god tier players when they're playing on linear you get what i'm saying I it's hard to i'm trying to explain the best way i can not trying to trigger people because i know mouse and keyboard players are, are will get triggered by trying to defend controller players in a way which i'm I am, but I'm not at the same time. You know what I mean? Like, I don't agree with the aim assist system. It is broken. They gotta do something about it. But at the same time, you can't just, like, force controller players to just to switch the mouse and keyboard in tourneys. You can't, you can't do that. You can't do that unless you're gonna have separate tourneys for controller players on PC to face other controller players on PC. I don't know how, I don't know how they can do it. I don't know how Epic can do that. I, I don't know if they even can do that, I, to be honest. Because, say, you can... Okay, so say you, you play on a controller, but then, you know, you could just unplug your controller from your PC. You can load up into a mouse and keyboard attorney and then just plug your, tr your controller back in. There, there's, I don't think there's any way possible they can do that. I don't, I don't know, man. It's, it's such a hard, um, touchy subject. But again, Epic does have to do something because eventually you're going to lose your top tier mouse and keyboard players from this. It's because... Everyone knows that control is broken right now, so everyone's going to make that switch to the controller. It is what it is, and it's unfortunate. But at the same time, you know, people are thriving on this game at the same time. So I remember back then, again, I'm not trying to piss people off on this, but I remember back then, no one was complaining about us until controller players started to get better at the game. I'll just say that. And I think most of you can agree with me on that, that play this game with the controller... No one was bitching and complaining about us until maybe during season seven or eight. That's when we started getting better at the game and then started outplaying mouse and keyboard players. So, I, again, I'm not trying to piss people off, but at the same time, you know, I got to say my part that, yes, I, I agree that it's broken, even assist is broken, but I also got to say my part defending the control of players in a way. But it is broken. It is. <laughs> so, again, I don't know what Epic can do, man. Uh, again, we all got to voice our opinions on this. We all got to talk about it and, you know, say what we got to say. And, again, uh, it, it all comes down to the big the big content creators or competitive players on controller to step up and say something to Epic. Make a video what Cypher did, man. They do something like that. Um, so, I don't know, man. It's, again, it's a touchy subject, but it is what it is at this moment. Um, we just have to wait and see what Epic's going to do in Season 3 of Chapter 2. So, again, we have to wait and see. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button. I do appreciate if you guys um, hit that like button. 
you're new here, hit that subscribe button, turn those notifications on. If you guys want, you can follow me on my social medias, my Twitter and Instagram is in the description box below. So is my Discord. You can join the Discord. I do appreciate it. And if you guys want, you can use my supporter credit code, BallerVC. It's all lowercase and all the words together. Again, leave your feedback in the comment section below what you think about this subject overall. Um, I appreciate the love and support, man. And I hope to see you guys in the streams. I do live stream here on the YouTube channel. So I hope to see you guys at the live streams. And other than that, guys, I'll talk to you all later. And again, leave your feedback about aim assist. What do you guys think about overall? I'll talk to you guys later, right? Peace, everyone.